Hello everyone, Indie Voice here with one of the most enjoyable first person shooter bullet time games with a horror twist I've ever experienced. And honestly, when I started playing this game, I didn't see anything hinting there was horror in it. Wow, they did something really creative here. Today we're looking at a game called Trip Hang 2. You play as an escaped soldier who has no memories of their past life, but it is infused with supernatural abilities. Revenge is on your mind and you'll stop at nothing to get what you want. Deliver devastating punches, sneak around in the shadows, wield explosive weapons, and give the bad guys a taste of their own medicine. In my personal experience of playing this, the vibe I instantly got after playing this game was fear. At this point, I immediately thought a girl in a little red dress would show up directly behind me. Trepang 2 takes a twist with an FPS with different missions, creatures otherworldly, and then suddenly goes back to regular soldiers trying to stop you and or capture you. There is a moment in the game where I randomly dropped into the back rooms, like, wait, where where was that even mentioned throughout this game where the back rooms would be involved? There's a lot of twists and turns within this game, something I very much recommend. And who doesn't like bullet time with cloaking? Running around, gunning through armies of enemies, seeing them fly everywhere from one planned explosion after the next. The pros and cons of Trepang 2, constant action, good bullet time mechanics, stealth, good story, amazing gunplay, and addictive gameplay. It doesn't work too well on the Steam Deck. It feels slightly repetitive, run, gun, restock, and repeat. Yes, this may remind everyone of the incredible amount of Fear 1, but at the same time, this does something completely different with its story and some parts of the gameplay, and again, who doesn't like bullet time? Tripang 2 gets a rating of highly recommended, need a game to destroy enemies and armies and people with a bit of a horror aspect, then this is definitely for you. Thank you for watching this video, and I'll see you next time.